Hello guys, welcome back to this channel. So I hope everyone is fine. So on that note, let's start this video. So guys, this is week three assignment regarding the course introduction to industry 4.1 industrial internet of things course. Friends, if you are new to our channel, please subscribe our channel, like this video and share this within your WhatsApp student groups so that it will reach to maximum number of students and everyone will get benefited, I hope. So friends, these are completely my probable solutions and I hope most of the solutions are correct but if there are any solution change to be made if you get to your notice please give your opinion in the comment section guys these are completely the probable solutions i have tried my best uh, to give you the best probable solutions so if i if any solution changes come to my notice i will definitely update it in the comment section so that's it guys so please watch the video till the end without skipping if you skip the video you may miss some content so do watch full video so now let's see the first question so first one what is the full form of cps cps so for first question the correct answer is option b guys cyber physical system so mark option b Now let's move on to the second question. So second one. Select the statement or statements that best describes a CPS. So for second question, uh, the probable answer is option D, all of the above. So mark fourth option. Now let's move on to the third question. So third one. The third question what does conversion refer refer to in context of cps architecture for iiot so for third question the correct answer is option b conversion of machine data to meaningful information so guys don't forget to like this video if you like the video then only our channel videos will uh, come into suggestions for many students so do like the video if you are benefited through our channel guys so keep supporting us like this so for third question the answer is option b now let's move on to the fourth one so fourth question select the statement which describes one of the limitations of smart sensors. So for fourth question, the probable solution is option A guys, sensor data aggregation not possible. So I am going with option A. So now let's move on to the fifth question. So fifth one, dash sensors are capable of processing sense data and performing predefined functions by processing data. Fill in the blank with the appropriate option. So for fifth question, the, the probable solution is option B, intelligent, intelligent. So mark option B guys. Now let's move on to the sixth question. So sixth one. Which of the following allows 
application specific customization of sensor nodes so for sixth question the probable answer is option b intelligent sensors option b intelligent sensors so now let's move on to the seventh question so mark option b for sixth one so seventh question guys now let's move on to the seventh one so before getting into the seventh question i want to uh, make a small announcement guys so so here it is so we have prepared nptl exam preparation mcqs for the course iiot 4.1 industrial iot course so guys with nearly five five years of nptl experience we have gathered the solutions uh, mcq questions so there are two types of packs guys savings pack and the other one is super savings pack so here it is a pdf access you will get in the google, uh, through google drive link so in the savings pack you will get 150 mcqs so the price is 300 rupees guys and here in the super savings pack you will get a huge number of 300 mcqs 300 mcqs which is worth just 500 only so here the price is doubled but here the price is not doubled so for each uh, mcq you will get it for less price only and the validity is till the exam day for both these packs so guys already many people have taken that so the access fee is up to three members so if you buy for 300 rupees then up to three members can access that same pdf guys so if you are uh, if you are classmates then you can form groups and purchase this 300 pack also this 500 pack so for 500 pack up to five members can access that guys so it's better to take 500 pack because you are getting 300 mcqs huge number of mcqs so if you if you are getting more mcqs it means uh, more practice right so more mcqs means more practice and better results so already many people have taken our pdfs guys and they are very much satisfied through our pdf content so hope you do that So up to three, five members can access this 300 MCQ spec guys. So the overall price is 500. You can individually contribute 100 MO. Uh, you can share 100 rupees uh, and form a group and you have to definitely purchase for 500 guys. No individual pricing is available. So the overall price is 500 rupees only. And for your ease of uh, money, you can, your classmates of five members can form a group and each can, each one can contribute 500 so that one of your team uh, teammate can collect all that uh, 500 money and you can purchase this pack guys if you send your email ids after payment then we will add you to this google dr link drive access guys only five of your members can able to watch that and the topic coverage in 150 pack is medium and if you see the syllabus coverage in uh, 500 rupees pack is very much high guys and search option is also available in both these packs in order to search your required question easily and it is also easy to revise because it's a pdf pack even going to the exam exam time also you can easily view that guys so if you want to buy any of this pack you can message me to this email id so i have already given my email id in the description box and also in the comment section so this is the email id guys only if you want to purchase then only message me guys so this is the uh, email id guys so my suggestion is to uh, is to take this 300 mcqs pack because you are getting more number of mcqs and the price is also almost same only because for pi, uh, per five persons it takes individual 100 rupees only right here also if you can see 300 rupees for up to three members even if you are one member or three members the price is 300 and 500 respectively so that's it guys so take a smart decision already many students have taken and got benefited guys so think once so now let's get back to the solutions so before that there is uh, 
one more memberships guys so if you see here so already we have pre here prepared this one guys iot 4.0 part 1 and part 2 course we have prepared uh, the mcqs so which is worth 119 rupees guys so here you can see that part 1 video so if you want to access that go to our channel click on join button here so Hello guys, select, welcome select to this. 119 per month pack and click on join and that's it that's it you will become member of our channel and you can get access to all these videos guys so here you will get uh, roughly 120 mcqs so the price is 119 per person guys and only for one month only so this is video format so if you want to join our channel you can click the join button and uh, join for 119 pack and you can watch these premium videos guys only members only videos so now let's get back to the solutions so seventh question so for dash allows employees to share information and solve business problems fill in the blank so for seventh question the answer is option d collaboration platform so mark option d guys so mark option d now let's move on to the eighth question now So eighth one. Coordination. Coordination is one of the four keys that enable co collaboration productivity. How can one initiate coordination? So for eighth question, the probable answer is option A guys. Provide authority to decision makers in a decentralized system. So mark option A. Now let's move on to the ninth question. So ninth one. So which of the following mean? Uh, once please wait so ninth question how many components are there in PLM that are used to handle a product across its lifetime so for ninth question the answer is option D nine guys so mark option D nine Now let's move on to the 10th question. So now let's see the 10th question. Which of the following statements is true about augmented reality? So for 10th question, the probable answer is option C guys. It amplifies the present perception of reality. So mark option C. Now let's move on to the 11th question guys. So 11th one. So this is not the answer. I will show you freshly. So 11th one. What is projection based AR? So for 11th question, the probable answer is option A guys. 
It gives outcomes by projecting light on real world surfaces. So mark option A. And now let's move on to the 12th question. So 12th one. Twelfth one, semi-immersive simulation is a type of what? It is option B, virtual reality, VR. So mark option B. And now let's move on to the 13th question, guys. So 13th one. So which of the following search methods is used by a computer program that does not use artificial intelligence? So for 13th question, the probable answer is option B guys, algorithmic. Algorithmic. So mark option B guys. Now let's move on to the 14th question. So 14th one, last but one question. Select the correct statement. So for 14th question, also the probable answer is option B guys. Deep learning is a subset of machine learning. So mark option B guys. And now let's move on to the final question of the assignment. That is 15th one. So 15th one. Which of the following statements is true about the GFS file system? So for 15th and last question, again the answer is Option B only guys. It is a distributed file system that supports large scale file system. So mark option B once again. So friends these are the solutions for week 3 assignment of IIoT 4.0 course. So hope this video helpful for you guys. If you feel the same please subscribe our channel, like this video and share this with your student WhatsApp groups guys. And don't forget to uh, take this purchase this pack guys. So very very important MCQs are given here. So you'll get 300 MCQs for just 500 rupees only guys. You'll get the validity till the exam day and up to 5 members can get access through this. There is, there is high topic coverage of the syllabus. Search option is also available and easy to revise also. So message me to this email ID guys. I have also given this in, my, uh, in the description box and also in the comment section. So that's it guys for this video. So hope this video helpful for you. If you feel the same, please subscribe our channel, like this video and share this within your WhatsApp student groups so that it will reach maximum number of students. And there is also YouTube memberships guys. So just 119 rupees only. You will get all these uh, videos, sub different subject video MCQs for 119 rupees only guys. So first go to our ch channel and click on join. Hello button. guys. Welcome to the and select this 119 per month third pack and click on join and make payment that's it you will become member of our channel and you can get access to all these videos guys so there will be nearly 100 to 120 mcqs so you can enjoy all these uh, videos guys so that's it for this video so until the next video goodbye thank you